Mix me up entirely. All right, he went for top tier. Still status. Pokemon. Still Pokemon, though. 20d3. Or uh, actually, it could be 20d3. Let's see. Uh, Tortilla the Pun. Oh, I'm sorry. I, that was not... I keep I keep mistak mistaking Tortilla the Pun for other people. This is the second <laughs> week in a row. Tortilla the Pun, nonetheless, a great DDD main. And he's going to show it off here against this Greninja, hopefully. Jay Real. Uh, this is a really questionable matchup right I now. I would say so, for Because sure. Greninja is just such a speedy guy. Then yeah. we got DDD here, a heavier character. But, you know, he really packs a punch, especially with that neutral B. That he's, he's landing quite a few of them. Yeah, he's got um, the, definitely the speed advantage over DDD, and I mean, combos on deck, uh, DDD being a bigger body. He's going to be able to live a lot longer, but he's going to eat a ton of damage way more quickly, especially because of uh, Greninja's frame data. Oh, he definitely he's really trying to get one of these spike balls in yeah. there. They're really playing the neutral right now, for sure. Oh, yeah, just waiting for those openings, and Greninja was able to get one. Oh, the uh, Gordo hitbox coming out just before... Uh, Greninja was able to sneak another up air in uh, Tortilla the Pun using his own up air to make his way safely to the stage. You might notice that the DDD is actually like going pretty high in the air when he does his jumps. Yeah. And this is where the matchup gets tricky regardless of uh, you, you know the matchup advantage because you're you start to build up so much percent on yourself and you can tell Jay Real started to reel in <laughs> his gameplay and slow it a bit down because uh, he was definitely at threat to dying to anything whatsoever. Nonetheless, he's going to pick it back up with that forwarder by the ledge, and we are at two stocks apiece at 0%. All right. And he was able to get an inhale in there, and you notice that you can spit your enemies back out there, but he just waits until they just naturally come out, and then will follow it up, usually with a side smash or an up smash. It's really interesting uh, combo or strategy to do to do. Okay, the up tilts into the up airs. Try to pick it up with a back air. Uh, try to catch the DI, but didn't quite have the range. Let's see here. Both characters just running around, waiting for an opening to come out. Ooh, the down tilt and forward smash not going to come out. Uh, Tortilla the Pun just jumping right over that. Forward tilt, I like it with the dash back. He was able to create the space, and he's putting J Real into his shield. He's going to want to be careful of that. He, uh, looks like Tortilla the Pun is looking for some sort of shield break setup at this point. Oh, and here we go. He's able to connect one of the spike balls. Can he get another one right off the ledge? And that one just missed, allowing Ooh. our Greninja to come back onto the stage. Let's see here. All right, the Gordo nearly killing. Uh, and as I mentioned, the uh, shield break threat is out there now. So it's going to be much easier for Tortilla Pun to land these hits because it, it definitely conditioned him to not shield quite as much often. And so two stocks up to one. Uh, Tortilla to Bun trying to close out this wow. game number one. He's already got 70% on the board. Oh, <laughs> the Gordo on the way back. Just spamming these spike balls, man. It's really working out for him. I know we see uh, J Real here trying to be careful of them. You'll see he jumped forward. Oh, he just barely missed that one. Wow, a great use of that teleport there. Ooh. And we see him fall off the stage. That ah. was really... And what happened? He, he ran off with a forward air, and I guess he just didn't input um, his up B quickly enough. Uh, Aww, so or maybe he just, you know, decided, you know, you got this. Let's move on to game two. That's also valid. Sometimes you just want to you, you get tilted mid-game, and you don't want to quite finish off that game. So you're like, reset. Uh, let, yeah. me, let me just reel it back together and uh, yeah. get back in there. I know. It is a lot of pressure being here, especially with, like, all these people around, so I could definitely understand the player from that perspective. Like, there's probably a lot going on in their minds, but don't worry, I believe that they can pick it back up in this next match. 100%. Uh, let's see how Jay Real is going to adjust to uh, Tortilla the Pun. If I had to say anything, I would say it would be that uh, he needs to rush him down a little bit more uh, or figure out which hit of his hitboxes will actually reflect Gordo back. Uh, he's mostly trying to maneuver around him. We haven't really seen him actually throw out a hitbox to hit the Gordo's back. Those actually still are pretty easy to hitbox, especially uh, hit back, especially if you have a multi hitbox or uh, disjoint like that. There's the Ooh, back air. Ooh, very clever use of the spike ball. He just shot it right back at him. Oh, and I, oh, is he gonna make it back oh, to this ledge? I saw him trying to make that wall yeah, hop. He, he got the wall hop, but uh, I. I guess, I'm not sure actually now that I think about it, I guess you only have one up B, so he couldn't really up B uh, again. Yeah, he really expanded his resources there. All right, Edmund, tell me about this matchup right now. We got 
our Greninja, he's really going way more aggressive, like you said. Yeah, absolutely. And I mean, it's starting to show he he did have that misplay with the SD, so he is going to have to play this a little bit more carefully. But he's starting to mix up his options more, landing on shield. Try to go with the Shadow Sneak edge guard, usually pretty good. But with DDD able to throw out that uh, Gordo, even in the his uh, recovery situations, um, it's going to be harder harder to hit. 139 now on Tortilla the Pun. He's still living on his first stock, though. Jay Real doing a really good job of uh, playing scarce and not getting hit too often, escaping that down throw. Back air combo and the forward smash going to connect to even out the stock counts. Tortilla the Pun at 0% and Jay Real at 46. He's oh. doing a much better job this game for sure. Oh, yeah. He just has to be really wary of these spike balls. There you go. He's being more careful. Ooh, and he just landed right under it. It's such a perfect way for DDD to start those combos, but he's able to sneak under. And we can see hopefully he'll be able to recover. Oh, Ooh. unfortunately not in that scenario. He read it like dash, a book. Yeah, dash attack going to cover that option and uh, put us down to two stocks to one for Tortilla the Pun on his potential game point right here. Here we go, and we got the Greninja trying to sneak up from underneath, charging that up smash, but wasn't able to finish it off. Got spike balls coming through. Ooh, jumping right over the inhale, landing with the neutral air. Uh, I can respect the attempt, wasn't able to follow up with too much more, but he's definitely starting to figure out the neutral a lot better. Oh, but here we go. Gotta figure out is how to get some of these stocks uh, early, not letting DDD live for too long. And uh, interesting that we went to this stage of, of any of them because it's got some of the larger blast zones. DDD's gonna live forever on this stage. Oh yeah, and I noticed that J-Real is trying to like go for some up combos, but that's hard with the DDD. He's very heavy. So to finish off a stock going upwards is a really interesting choice. Yeah, it's looking like uh, this may be in the bag for Tortilla the Pun. He gets the inhale. Yeah, he's he, he went for that a couple of times. Down to it looking like it's going <gasps> to actually kill. And, and the snipe. Wow, but not going to be enough to get the stock. Jay Real back at the ledge and the F tilt. He's <laughs> alive. Also not enough. He's alive. Greninja. Three for three. Three for three. 157 percent. Let's go. Oh, Patiently oh, waiting. Hit. Oh, I knew, oh, he hit it right back. Did oh, you see all that dude. kick? <laughs> Deflected that spike ball though. Yeah, but Tortilla the pun ready to just reflect it right back. <laughs>